the role of National Assembly in overseeing the security sector has been uh, drastically degraded uh, in the past few years, particularly since 2016. Uh, so uh, I will mention some of these uh, misuses and mechanisms. For example, there was uh, an extensive use of urgent procedures uh, in the, the past few years. So without any clear and logical justification, uh, it was used in order to avoid public uh, discussions. Um, uh, also, a very popular practice uh, during this past convocation was um, to when the ruling party and the ruling coalition actually would submit a huge number of amendments to a certain law or document being discussed. Um, and I'm talking about uh, hundreds and hundreds of very similar amendments just to shorten the time for, for discussion and to prevent oppositional MPs to, to contribute. Um, also, um, it is important to mention the committees uh, in charge of overseeing security sector. Uh, these committees have been very passive in the past few years, uh, and their role has uh, mostly come down to uh, just um, adopting draft laws, uh, confirming international agreements, and just formally reviewing reports of the uh, security uh, sector actors. Um, this uh, a big problem in the work of this, uh, these committees is that uh, only a small number of MPs actually had uh, a security clearance, so the certificate necessary to access uh, confidential data, uh, and a small number of those who did were actually from the ruling party. Uh, also, uh, duration of the sessions of these committees uh, speaks a lot about the quality of the debates that were uh, that, they, that took place in, in these uh, committees. Uh, I will just uh, mention one illustrative example. Uh, at the end of last year, uh, there was a committee session uh, where MPs were supposed to discuss uh, two core strategic documents, so the national security strategy and defense strategy, alongside with some other two laws and a decision, and this session lasted only for 28 minutes. This legislative function and this oversight role of the parliament uh, has been misused uh, in order to change the rules in, in a legal way and to, to uh, legalize bad practices, just to simply transfer them pro from practice to the paper. And that is how this National Assembly was captured and how it further contributed to capturing the, the security uh, sector.